we gotta get going. Hey, Alan, they want to see you upstairs right away. Oh, yeah? What would you do? Upstairs? See you later. Oh, ho. Good morning, Alan. How are you this morning? Good morning. I'm doing all right. Have a seat. All right. They told me down on the dock you wanted to see me. Yes, I do. Can you get your cup of coffee? No, no. I just had one. Thank you. Okay. The reason I called you this morning is I want to talk to you about the operator's exam. Right. Right. You passed the test. You know that. Uh, I've looked at all of the applicants, and I've made a decision, and I've chosen Janet for the job. Janet! I, I knew you'd be feeling this way, <sighs> but... Uh, I want to tell you that if I could have put you in the position, I would have. Uh, I had to choose Janet because of the affirmative action program. Affirmative action? Yes, that's the policy oh, of the company. Come I on, no, Mr. No Titterow, this is my job we're talking about here. Everybody knows I'm supposed to get this job. Bob had this job before me. Now it's my turn. John, it's only been here for a year. I realize I've been that. here for years. I All my supervisors that. have said I'm a good worker. You got any complaints about me? No, I don't. I know you don't. I'm a good worker. I've I'm stuck sorry. with this company for years. And what does the company I, do to me? This is my that. job we're it's talking the policy, about. policy, Alan. I have no choice in the matter. Oh, you don't have any it. choice in the matter. I want you to understand. This, Mr. Tinnerelli, I already have this money spent from well, this job. This is my job, and I, you're giving it to Janet. I can't help you there, Alan. I really can't. Mr. Tinnerelli, no. this is my job. I what can you do about it? I can't help you. I can't Mr. do You're a supervisor, choice. Mr. Tinnerelli. This is my job. I have no choice in the matter, Alan. Everybody's answerable to somebody, and I Well, can't if you can't do anything about it, then there's no use us talking. I'm sorry you feel that way. Never Alan? mind. Never mind. You're sitting up there in my seat, in my job. If you're not man enough to handle this job, you could just... Oh, figure it out for yourself. So you can take my job too? No, I'll do it myself. Oh. Oh. Hey, Janet, can I give you a hand? No, I can do it myself. Sure, you don't need a third hand. I said I could do it myself. Sure? Positive. I have to do everything around here 110% anyway, so why don't you just leave me alone? Okay. Hey. Okay. They told me down on the dock you wanted to see me. Yes, I do. Can you get your cup of coffee? No, no, I just had one. Thank you. Okay, the reason I called you this morning is I want to talk to you about the operator's exam. Right, right. You passed the test, you know that. Uh, I've looked at all of the applicants, and I've made a decision, and I've chosen Janet for the job. 
I Janet. Know, I knew you'd be feeling this way, uh, but uh, I want to uh -huh. tell you that uh, if I could have put you in a position, I would have. Uh, I had to choose Janet because of the affirmative action. Affirmative program. action? Yes, that's the policy uh, of the company. Come on, Mr. No Titero, this is my job we're talking about here. Everybody knows I'm supposed to get this job. Bob had this job before me, now it's my turn. John, it's only been here for a year. I realize I've been that. here for years. I All my supervisors that. have said I'm a good worker. You got any complaints about me? No, I don't. I know you don't. I'm a good worker. I've I'm stuck sure. with this company for years, and what does the company I, do to me? I realize this is that. my job we're it's talking policy, about. policy, Alan. I have no choice in the matter. Oh, you don't have understand. any choice in the matter. I want you to understand. This, Mr. Tinnerelli, I already have this money spent from well, this job. This is my job, and I, you're I giving it to Janet. I can't help you there, Alan. I really can't. Mr. Tinnerelli, no. this is my job. I what can you do about it? I can't help you. I can't Mr. do You're a supervisor, Mr. Tinnerelli. This is my job. I have no choice in the matter, Alan. Everybody's answerable to somebody, and I Well, can't if you help can't do anything about it, then there's no use us talking. I'm sorry you feel that way. Never Alan? mind. Never mind. You're sitting up there in my seat, in my job. If you're not man enough to handle this job, you could just... Oh, figure it out for yourself. So you can take my job too? No, I'll do it myself. Oh. Oh. Hey, Janet, can I give you a hand? No, I can do it myself. Sure you don't need a third hand. I said I could do it myself. Sure? Positive. I have to do everything around here 110% anyway, so why don't you just leave me alone? Okay. Hey. Okay. Yeah, we'll have in a minute. What's this? No, that's the what? short one. That's the short that's... one. Come on over. Okay. Here, let me. All right, baby. Come on, come on, what's all that? Yeah, yeah, cool yourself. We'll have it. Pull. Come on, you bend it when you snap it in there. You know. Yeah. Start this yeah. one. The other side, the other side. Okay, come on. Don't bend it. Up. We're going to bend it. Oh, the whole crew waiting for yeah, I know, I know. Get it up. Uh, 
got stuck. I've had it. Yeah, I'll get it. Hey, Cindy, will you give uh, Lou a hand making up that down guy? Sure. Hey, Lou, I gotta give you a hand here. I'm ready for it. That's, yeah, we'll have in a minute. What's this? No, that's the what? short one. That's the short that's... one. Come on over. Cool yourself. We'll have it. Pull. Come on, you bend it when you snap it. You know. Yeah. Start this yeah. one. The other side. The other side. Okay, come on. Don't bend it. You're gonna I bang it. The whole crew waiting. Uh -huh. I know. I know. So, if you fellas could get the hot sticks ready to go, and if you need any mechanicals or anything, you can throw them in the Okay. Hey, we'll do it. And I don't know, I think we got pretty well all the hardware that we don't need to, uh, to do the job. And you know basically what. Hey, Al. Uh, I'm going to have one ahead and take up the hand line. Linda, Vicky, fourth pair, please. Uh, I want you to work with Al making up the hand lines. We got the material was all drawn out. All we got to do is start putting them together. The Jeep is a mess. The guys are from staff everywhere. No, no problem, no problem. Linda will take care of the Jeep. I want you two to work together getting these hands okay. lines. hand lines ready to go. I got to get going to this meeting because I'm going to be late. And every time I come in here for one of these, it seems like I'm running late. Okay. Hey, Rod. Yeah. We're going to look at this material over here. It's really working fast. Okay. Here, hold this while I make this splice. Why? Can't you do it yourself? Sure, I can do it myself. I'm always working by myself. Where are you going? I'm going to the can. To the can. Sticks look good. They're getting there. How you doing, Al? I'm doing all right, but I'd be doing a lot better if I had some decent help. She'd give you good help, Al. We'll give you the best help that we have on the crew. She's no help. She's somewhere up in the john right now. Been gone ever since you've been gone. 
I'm always spending my time working by myself, ever since you've signed up to work with me. I don't know where you hired her from. She's just here for a paycheck anyway. Well, welcome back. while I make this splice. Why? Can't you do it yourself? Sure, I can do it myself. I'm always working by myself. Where are you going? I'm going to the can. To the can. Look good. They're getting there. How you doing, Al? Doing all right, but I'd be doing a lot better if I had some decent help. We'll give you good help, Al. We'll give you the best help that we have on the crew. She's no help. She's somewhere up in the john right now. You've been gone ever since you've been gone. I'm always spending my time working by myself ever since you've signed up to work with me. I don't know where you hired her from. She's just here for a paycheck anyway. Well, welcome back. Harry, the 
soap there, Bill? Yeah, I'm just about done with it. I wonder if I'll ever get this stuff off my hands. Yeah, well, Lou, they did it again. They hired another minority for that position. What? Yeah. Can you believe that? Well, that doesn't surprise me. I heard they hired him 55 off the list. Well, that takes me off. You know, I spent two weeks studying for that exam. I take a Saturday off and go down and take it away from my family. And I end up passing number three on the list. I mean, what can I do? Hey, I'm number five on the list. What's I know exactly what you're talking about. What are you guys yeah, doing about? about? Affirmative action. What do you think? You think white men have a chance around here anymore? Hell, I don't know. Affirmative action is something we're all going to have to live with. Yeah. Comes from downtown. What do you really think? I, hey, I don't buy that. 55 on the list. Come on. How good can the guy be? How would I know? I've never met the guy. Yeah, but Bob, what do you really think? Do white men have a chance? Yeah. Well, I don't know. I've heard it all before. I don't know. What do you really think, Tom? What am I gonna what am I gonna be able to tell you to convince you? I don't know. Want to hand me the soap there, Bill? Yeah, I'm just about done with it. I wonder if I'll ever get this stuff off my hands. Yeah, well, Lou, they did it again. They hired another minority for that position. What? Yeah. Can you believe that? Well, that doesn't surprise me. I heard they hired him 55 off the list. Well, that takes me off. You know, I spent two weeks studying for that exam. I take a Saturday off to take it away from my family. And I end up passing number three on the list. I mean, what can I do? Hey, I'm number five on the list. What's well, exactly what you're talking about? What are you guys yeah, talking about? about? Affirmative action. What do you think? You think white men have a chance around here anymore? Hell, I don't know. Affirmative action is something we're all going to have to live with. Yeah. Comes from downtown. What do you really think? I, hey, I don't buy that. 55 on the list. Come on. How good can the guy be? How would I know? I've never met the guy. Yeah, but Bob, what do you really think? Why did have a chance? Yeah, well, I don't know. I've heard it all before. I don't know. What do you really think, Tom? What am I gonna what am I gonna be able to tell you to convince you? I don't know. You got that extension cord of mine? Yeah, it's up front. The one laying on the bench. Yeah, I got it. Morning. Hey, uh, Rod. Hey. Yeah. Down forklift out in the uh, wire yard. Okay. Take care of that first thing this morning? Sure. Yeah, no. Uh, I'm going to be out there in a few minutes and we'll check out that wire for Preston Nelson. Sounds good. Why don't you take Vicky to New Apprentice with you? Okay. Yeah, if I have to. Yeah. Okay. I do. Do you like it? Yeah. <sighs> Vicky, if it's uh, what I need you to do is go look at Rod. Oh, the, the blonde haired guy. Yeah. Right here. Oh, okay. okay. Thanks. Rod. Yeah. Hi, I'm Vicky. Where are we going today? I'm going to send you out to Swanson. I know. I know you can handle it. Well. Yeah, I'm going. I'm buying a lot of money. Excuse me, I need my toolbox. Sure I didn't quite catch where we're working today. Uh, over in the uh, real yard. Okay, thank you. Wire. Out in the yard, the forklift hooked in? Yeah, yeah. Hey, good luck, you guys. Hope you fix that pretty soon. I gotta go now. Okay, yeah. we'll get it. What's it actually doing? Well, we seem to be having some problems lifting the forks. Okay, why don't you step down, let me get in and give it a try. See what I can find. All yours. Well, good, I finally found you. What seems to be the problem? Well, is it the solenoid? The battery? Look, you're the one that should know. You're the one taking all the classes. Yeah, I do know. You got hydraulic fluid running out of here like crazy. Hey, 
rock. You got that extension cord of mine? Yeah, it's up in front. Go and land on the bench. Yeah, I got it. Morning. Hey. Rod. Yeah. Get down forklift out in the uh, wire yard. Okay. Take care of that first thing this morning. Sure. And uh, I'm going to be out there in a few minutes and we'll check out that wire for Preston Nelson. Sounds good. Uh, why don't you take Vicky to know apprentice with you this morning, okay? Yeah, if I have to. Yeah. Do you like it? Yeah. Uh, Vicky, if it's, uh, what I need you to do is go work with Rod. Oh, the, the blonde haired guy? Yeah, right here. Oh, okay, okay, thanks. Rod? Yeah? Hi, I'm Vicky. Where are we going today? Excuse me, I need my toolbox. Sure. I didn't quite catch where we're working today. Uh, over in the, uh, Okay, thank you. Wire. Out in the yard, the forklift poked in? Yeah, yeah. You got a forklift poked What's the deal is it? Hey, good luck, you guys. Hope you fix that pretty soon. I got to go now. Okay, yeah. we'll get it. What's it actually doing? Well, we seem to be having some problems lifting the forks. Okay, why don't you step down? Let me get in and give it a try. See what I can find. All yours. I finally found you. What seems to be the problem? Paul, is it the solenoid? The battery? Look, you're the one that should know. You're the one taking all the classes. Yeah, I do know. You got hydraulic fluid running out of here like crazy. 